Have you ever found yourself stuck trying to figure out how to redirect a form submission in HTML? It can be really frustrating, especially when you just want things to work smoothly. If that's you, then you're in the right place. Today, we're going to tackle how to redirect to another page after submitting a form in HTML. I totally understand your struggle. Many new coders face this challenge when they start working with forms. You're definitely not alone in this. It's a common issue that can leave you scratching your head. Let's dive into the specific situation at hand. One user recently asked, how can I redirect to another URL after submitting my form? They shared their code and mentioned that after submission, it just redirects to a default page instead of the desired URL. Sound familiar? If so, let's work through this together. So, what's going on here? When you submit a form in HTML, it typically sends the data to the action URL specified in the form tag. However, if you want to redirect to another page after submission, you need to handle that with a bit of JavaScript or server-side code. Let's break it down step by step. And stick around. I have a handy tip at the end that will make your form submissions even smoother. You won't want to miss it. To redirect to another page after submitting the form, the user can utilize JavaScript. First, they need to add an event listener to the form submission. Next, within the event listener, the user should submit the form using JavaScript and then redirect to the desired URL. This can be done using the Fetch API. Now, the user should ensure that the form action URL is correct and that the method is set to post. This is crucial for the form submission to work properly. Finally, the user can test the form by filling it out and clicking the Submit button. They should observe that the form submits and then redirects to the specified URL. Fun fact, did you know that the first web forms were created in the early 1990s? They were a game changer for online interaction. And look how far we've come since then. Now, let's look at the answers provided by other users. An alternative approach suggested by a user involves validating the form inputs before redirecting. They recommend checking if the full name and address fields are filled out correctly. If both fields have more than two characters, the form will redirect to a new page. If not, error messages will be displayed. Let's check out another perspective from a different user. An alternative solution provided by another user suggests adding a script at the end of your form. This script will automatically submit the form programmatically. That's all for that response. Let's see what someone else had to say. An alternative solution provided by another user involves setting the form's target to blank, which opens the submission in a new tab. They suggest adding an input ID for JavaScript recognition and using a script to redirect after submission. Here's that handy tip I promised. Always test your form submissions in different browsers to ensure compatibility. This can save you a lot of headaches down the line. And there you have it. You should now be able to redirect your form submissions to any URL you want. Remember, practice makes perfect. If you found this video helpful, please hit the subscribe button for more coding tips. And don't forget to check out our bonus content on advanced form handling.